Hey, in this short video, I'm going to chat about the importance of taking health advice from an expert. To kick things off, talking about other experts, I'm going to interview Simon, who's an Italian and a chef and the owner of Parma Food Truck, and he's going to chat to us about some expert tips on Italian cuisine. Hey, it's Dr. Levi from Wiser's Road Chiropractic. I'm hanging out with Chef Simon, who's also the owner of Parma Food Truck. And Chef Simon's going to share with us some tips about Italian cooking. Now, the thing with Italian cuisine is it's very often done, but I don't think, to be honest, it's done very well. So, we have Simon, who is not only a chef, but is also an Italian and hails from Parma region in Italy, where they take their food very seriously. And he's going to share with us the three biggest mistakes he feels people make with Italian cooking. So, kick it off, Simon. What do you okay. think? Hi, everyone. Uh, first of all is ingredient. Choice of ingredient. Super important. Uh, spend an extra dollar on something that is good. Good quality food. Don't overcook it. As don't overprep it. Don't add too much. As I talk with many people, it's like add mushroom, add cream to your bolognese. Don't do it. Just stick with the simple, make it good, and take your time. As a third tip, take your time. The longer you cook your sauces, your bolognese, your napoletana, take your time. Don't have no shortcuts in the kitchen. For us, is in a truck, or even for myself, is just good ingredients, no shortcuts, don't add stuff to it just because you think it's fun. <laughs> it's just keep it simple, keep it good, and you will see the difference. like you probably shouldn't take Italian cooking advice from someone who isn't an Italian chef, you probably shouldn't take your health advice from people that aren't experts. So if you are struggling with back pain or you've got nervous system issues, I think it's really important that you find a back pain and nervous system expert. So often I hear stories about people that are told never to go see a chiropractor from people that have never been to a chiropractor themselves. Or they're getting health advice from someone who has no idea about health and the main priority is just to write scripts and to push drugs. If you're looking for a holistic approach to health, if you're interested in getting your back and your nervous system sorted out, then it's probably in your best interest to look at an expert in those areas. Thanks again for watching and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed that video, I'm always sharing new tips, tricks and hints about health, so be sure to click the subscribe button so you don't miss out. Thanks again and speak to you soon.